Okay, I'm recording, and... Alright, what's up guys, uh, this is D1 Snipes here today, and uh, I've got a review partner on uh, first thoughts and impressions for GTA 5. Uh, I'm going to head outside here and I'm gonna have a gentleman calling there. Uh, just kind of take a look around so as we talk clear. about our first impressions of the game. And uh, we'll see what uh, Stu thinks. So we're, it's nighttime out here. We're just going to take a stroll down the street. I'm not going to do anything crazy. So, uh, Stu, what did you expect yeah. from GTA 5 compared to what you got out of it so far? Honestly, like I was thinking um, the Vice City days and the Grand Theft Auto 3 days you know, were gone. I felt like, you know, when I was a kid when I would play those games, that it really hit home because it had like just a certain flair to it. Maybe it was just because it was new then. But then they did the Grand Theft Auto, Grand Theft Auto 4, and it, I mean, I liked the game. I, I bought all the expansions and stuff. I played it. I loved it. But like it, it had this new feel, but it wasn't quite classic. Like it wasn't Grand Theft Auto to me. Yeah, it, was it wasn't the GTA you fell in love with. Like Saints Row. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I, I feel the same. So, um, but the first, go ahead. The, the first part, like uh, the, the flashback, and then like you, you got, to, you can, you can run. At a, like a certain, like instead of just walking, and then you got to sprint, sprint, sprint. You can, you can jog, and then you can sprint if you need to. And the cover system, I really like it too. Like you, sl like you run, you slide yeah. into cover, or. You just you know you get into it like you would get yeah, into. Yeah, that's that was the. For lack of better terms, mm -hmm. not blocking. One of the things that I said was, uh, in my first uh, part, was that it almost felt like Gears of War. The gunplay did. Like yeah, it was it was even definitely. smoother getting in and out of cover than Gears of War was, because in Gears of War you were either yeah. in or you were out of cover, but in this it feels like it's pretty fluid like you just kind of run from cover to cover and that cover button works really well also I don't know if you yeah. noticed it or the not word. but like the, the the aim assist or like the uh, like little snap to it like if you flick the yeah. uh, analog stick and aim to I didn't get to do that yet I've, I've, I've tried it in the gunfights I've been in but it's, I, I didn't it's get it to flip. pretty sweet I was impressed with that I did not think anything like that would be in the game honestly so I was Yo, I was man, pretty I'm surprised to see that right so I like how the guns handle oh yeah yes the, the guns handle really well that's really smooth gunplay the best of any GTA game I think so far the word I would put it like like we were talking earlier before the interview business, um, crisp. Yeah. A lot of the game is really yes, crisp. It's very polished. I'm like, glad clean. that they delayed it to make it like yeah. this. If that was what they felt wasn't ready, I guess. If they wanted to tighten everything up, I Yeah. I really think they did a good job with that. I just hope the multiplayer feels the same. They brought way. back the yeah. barber shop. They brought back the, the you know, pay and sprays. I, I think they had those in the fourth one too, but like these are like the pay and sprays, and you got ammunition. Which is the gun yeah. scores. And it's, it's really nice to have like the customization of your character. Did you change your clothes? No, yet? I haven't. I'm just doing, uh, up until I saved, I just did the, uh, I just did that first mission. And now I'm just kind of doing a night walk right. while we're doing this interview. Um, what was yeah. I was going to ask you? You could, like, when you go into his house, Franklin's house, he's got, like, the, you know, an open closet there. You can change in all different clothes. It's so nice. You can mix and match things. They look really good. Oh, yeah. I'll have to mess with that in my, my next I, I like the customization. Yeah, after I saw his car, yeah. just the default custom was pretty sweet and it sounded great so I thought that was pretty cool how they each character has a unique uh, vehicle oh that's leading into my next question 
How do you feel about the characters so far? Characters, I, I like it. Like, the dude was uh, giving all his frustration out at that damn uh, psychiatrist meeting yeah. or whatever. That was kind of cool. As soon as he said that damn kid, all he does is jack off, play <laughs> video games. I was like, heard that. I just. They they all sound like things that uh, real people would say. Like nothing, nothing sounds too scripted. Yeah. It's all, it's all things you think somebody in that situation <laughs> would say. Especially Franklin's uh, buddy oh, yeah. or whatever. The, yeah. <laughs> the other black guy is hilarious. Friend that's in the missions. Oh my goodness. I can't hang with you no more. You're too crazy. I think you finally lost it. Oh man, that's just that Apache blood in me. They <laughs> look at him going tomahawk at that ass. You know, it's <laughs> random stuff like that. Kills I think me it's with great, like the way they, yeah, the characters interact. It's not some scripted, like you said earlier. It's not scripted. It's, it's just I felt like maybe the the voice actors let it flow. Yeah. In the, I mean, maybe they had some kind of script to it, but I bet you there's a lot of yeah. improv too. Well, the driving, however, go ahead. Bit touchy. Yeah. Dri <laughs> At first, first it was compared really to touchy. the fourth one. I'll take it, but yes, yes, I agree. But Definitely I think it's there. I think it's gotten better. But than the it. ability and the ability helps a ton. Got, it makes it really exactly. nice. Exactly. So you can definitely tell yeah. that he's going to be the, makes you... the getaway driver for later missions. He'll be that guy for sure. chasing down vehicles or running away. I'm really curious what the rest of the I know, guys I'm, got. I'm really interested to see that. I'm sure you'll get to it tonight, and I'll probably talk to you about it before I, I even get to tomorrow. Yeah. I just, I'm going to dive headfirst into this thing. Oh. And really customize every yeah. character. Try to get everybody's skills up. That's a cool thing too. Is that they got a skill. They got like their their flying ability, their stealth ability, shooting, uh, driving, stamina, lung capacity, yeah. all that stuff. You can upgrade that throughout the game by completing um, it said hobbies and and like side missions and stuff like that. I don't know. I don't know maybe not side missions, but just like yeah. activities. That'll increase. Like maybe running a triathlon. I remember in San Andreas, if you did a triathlon, you could get your swimming yep, and your true. your lung capacity mm -hmm. to increase and all that. So this this is exciting. And also yoga is an activity. I don't know why, but I really want to dive in <laughs> and try to find this yoga activity and see what the hell it's all, right. all about. You know. Well, I gotta get some sleep. I gotta work tomorrow. This is gonna wrap up our interview with Stupal. We'll probably talk to you tomorrow after Wait. you've played with it for a few more hours and let us know what you get to, Dan. Sure. All right. Thanks for being with us. I'll let you know, Heath. Yeah, thanks for having me. Peace out, guys. We'll see you tomorrow.